Despite the national government's instruction for state schools in Papua New Guinea not to charge project fees, this has fallen on deaf ears with several schools. This was an issue raised at the 2015 first parliament sitting today in Port Mosby. Lay MP Lojaya Koze was concerned at the manner direction was received as children were refused enrollment and sent back home for not paying project fees. Project fees will be no more. Uh, could the good minister please clarify to the Honourable House so that uh, our people are clear with regards to school fee project fees? Egyptary MP David Array also raised similar concerns but on the mechanisms in place that would guarantee parents and school authorities that this project fee is illegal. Uh, for the, um, the project fees. And so that is the reason why you are appealing here in, in the parliament for them not to pay. But what mechanisms have you put in place so that the schools do not enforce these project fees? But National Education Minister Nick Kuman reaffirmed the national government's pre-tuition fee policy stance with its focus on providing accessibility to children. While millions have been appropriated into this exercise, the instruction must be followed. The National Education Department sets the school fees. The national government has taken responsibility by paying all the school fees for all, every child that goes to school from elementary school, starting from elementary all the way to, up to grade 12. And therefore, there should not be any other form of fees to be collected by every institution where the government pays the school fees. The education minister pointed out schools shouldn't impose project fees and those found will be dealt with through provincial education advisors and standard offices. Four numbers for each region, one number for each region. And parents who are paying, uh, forced to pay project fees right throughout the country, you are entitled to ring those numbers and register your uh, concern and register your complaints and those will come back to the National Education Department who will deal with those schools and the boards responsible. A circular instruction has been sent to all schools. Fabian Hakelitz, National MTV News.